road trip to Mountain View to visit the Ozark Folk Center State Park. It looks like there's so much to do and see here. So I'm gonna go meet up with park interpreter Keith and see what he recommends we do first. Kirsten, welcome to the Ozark Folk Center State Park. Thanks, Keith. I'm so happy to be here. What part of the park are we in right now? Well, right now we are in the heart of the craft village, so we're surrounded by all 20 shops with a, a variety of different artists that are making, selling, and demonstrating right here in Mountain View, Arkansas. And what are we going to see in all of these buildings? Our mission here at the Folk Center, since we opened up back in 1973, is to keep alive the Ozark way of life. Mm -hmm. So you can hear the, the old time mountain music being played, but you can also uh, get a chance to learn a little bit about some of the old cabin crafts, like quilting, like woodworking, and a number of, uh, of modern crafts that we also celebrate here at the park. So everything from blacksmithing, to knife making, um, candle making, stained glass, you name it, and folks can check it out here. All of these artists are fascinating. Is there any way I can learn to do these things? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, for folks that are beginners or people who are interested in honing their craft and learning a little bit more, all of the artisans here at the park do offer craft classes year-round, and uh, you can check that out on our ticketing website, ozarkfolkcenter.ticketleap. That's ticket, L-E-A-P. Com. Definitely going to check some of those out. And it is getting close to lunchtime. I know you all have a restaurant as well. Can we go look at that? Yes, the Skillet restaurant is open up whenever the Craft Village is open. So let's go check it out. guys, how's it going? Good. It's going good. Kirsten, this is Jessica Sterling. She's the head manager here at the Skillet Restaurant. Jessica, it smells so good in here. What are some of the things that y'all are known for? Well, I'm glad it smells good. We've got several specialties, but first, let me say, our number one thing here is our Southern hospitality. We love to have a warm, welcome home when everybody walks in the door. Then we'll get you seated with some of our uh, fresh rosemary lemonade made out of our Heritage Herb Garden right here, fresh grown, fresh picked every day. We have a new addition to our menu this year, our s'more. Ozark s'more, so we bring out your little iron skillet, we toast it right in front of you, however you want it. And uh, we have an Ozark sampler, which is our num one of our number one sellers. It's got chicken and dumplings, pinto beans, turnip greens, cornbread. It's a little sample of everything we do in the Ozarks. A little bit for everybody. There's all kinds of things here to try. You're sure to leave full, happy, and feeling like part of the family. <laughs> that all sounds wonderful. Uh, we're gonna find a seat and I'm gonna grab some lunch. Awesome, thanks, glad to have y'all. stop for a refreshing drink at Jordan's Quick Stop. And the best way to take a road trip is at a new Buick or GMC from Central. So now we're at Loco Ropes. I'm here with the operations manager, Bob. And Bob, what is there to do here? Oh gosh, we've got a number of things to do here, Kirsten. We have what we call our tower adventures. And right now, as you're aware, we're standing on the top of the tower. Um, and we have three adventures that you can do. We have the flying pig zip line, which is right here behind you, and I think you'll be doing that here in just a few minutes. Uh, the hot shot free fall, it's one of those where you clip in, you walk up, and then you step off and fall straight down to the ground. Also on the tower, we have climbing walls. So those are tower adventures, and then we have, again, the treetop challenge courses. We have three of those, line one, line two, and line three. We call them loco lines, okay? <laughs> Um, but we've had as young as four years old and as old as 74 years old do all three courses. So I guess let's get started. You bet. Let's do it. Thanks for joining me as I visited the Ozark Folk Center for more road trip ideas and to see where we go next, go to KIT8.com. Flash road trip. See you next time.